So, welcome to week eight then of the Starters Orders Online League. It's Glorious Goodwood this week. And we've got another action-packed week for you. Starting off then at Goodwood with a handicap to get things underway. Then we'll have the first of the group races. We've got with the Molcombe Stakes, a five furlong event for two-year-olds. We followed up by the Lennox Stakes, which is one of the biggest seven furlong races of the season. Not many group one races for seven furlong horses. In fact, there's only one in the whole season. That's the Pre de la Fright, which comes up later on in the season. So this group two, the Lennox Stakes, is a rare opportunity for those seven furlong specialists to hit the big prize and King's Ghost for John Morgan looks to be the top rating one in there but it looks like it's going to be a wide open race one or two dropping back from a mile and a couple stepping up from six furlongs as well then there'll be another handicap the bet three six five summer handicap after that one and then we go to the goodwood stakes which is a long distance two mile five furlong naught to 100 handicap after that the gordon stakes which is a bit of a St. ledger trial although it's only over a mile and a half treaty of melbourne for paul Rhodes will probably be the uh, the hot one in that race and then the big race of the whole meeting is the kipco sussex stakes a group one over a mile the first opportunity really for the three-year-olds to take on the older generation and the uh, three-year-olds look to be just the better although trick play one million from molly at surfer will be trying to keep the prize for the four-year-olds after that we're going to kempton park for some races on the dirt the middle distance championship races and also the sprint as well not to forget the marathon as well that comes up there as well so good mix of races over at kempton and then we end the day with a couple more races at goodwood another stairs race this time the low rated darren howells stairs which has only got five runners so everybody should take out a little bit of pocket money in that one including the man who the race is named after things will end today with the verve clico vintage stakes which is a group two over seven furlongs for two-year-olds and another unbeaten john morgan horse heads the way there ghost zapper named after himself of course so there you go that's day one then and we'll see you tomorrow